Hey guys, Dustin here. I've been back from my cheese trip or fromaggio voyaggio for about a week, week and a half-ish. Um, I know I said I was going to put up some videos or start really working on videos as soon as I got home. But, you know, when you come back from vacation, you actually kind of need a vacation from vacation to decompress and get your head back together and get back in the game. So that's what I've been doing. Um, today I'm testing out some lighting, a green screen, and uh, new audio. Hopefully that turns out all right. Um, if not, this video will go up anyway, just to, you know, see how that works out. One of the things I've been doing, though, while I've been decompressing and kind of planning things is... Um, I've been trying to decide if I want to do another year-long language project like I did with Swedish, um, except obviously this time I would do the entire year on YouTube instead of, you know, half on a blog, half on YouTube. Um, I do remember that I made a lot of progress with Swedish as soon as I started uploading videos, and I would like to do that, you know, again, in a more serious capacity. Uh, so, like, take a year and just do a language. I just don't know which language. Uh, I would want to do yet. If I was going to spend a year on a single language, it would definitely have to be something that would, you know, not only be fun for me to learn, but also somehow be useful in my daily life. Uh, maybe further my career or open up better job opportunities or just maybe enhance travel. But however, since my primary travel is around the United States, um, really English is what you need in most cases and I pretty much got that covered so uh, I mean there's certain places you can go where other languages are spoken like in my area even there's a lot of Spanish spoken uh, there's a small Russian community that I've encountered twice completely by accident and I have no idea how to intentionally find them uh, there's also a small Chinese community as well so I mean there's options here just in my area but I don't know if any of those options are options that I want to explore. So I've been taking my time and thinking about that. Um, but I've also been, you know, doing channel related things behind the scenes. I've created a new intro and um, I'll go ahead and put that up. Hello. Guten Tag. Namaste. Hola. Hey. Bonjour. Salam. Ni hao. Buna ziwa. Annyeonghaseyo. Privyet. Saluton. So that was, that was couple hours of painstaking just frame by frame stuff that because I'm completely terrible at you know after effects and that's what it was created with but I like it so we're gonna use it but like I said I don't know if if, um, if I want to start a year-long process on one language or if I just want to go back to just sampling the languages for a couple months at a time like I have been before I mean there's so many so many languages that I want to cover at least in part um, you know, I still want to give Hindi an honest try. Um, Romanian has been on my list forever. Korean, um, I wouldn't mind learning Greek. I tried Greek once, uh, while I wasn't making videos and honestly, just none of it would stick. I can, I can say, uh, Telo Uzo. That's about it. And I don't even know if that's correct. So anyway, that's what this video was. Just a quick update, test out some stuff, let you know where I'm at and what might possibly coming in the future. If you've got any suggestions, any ideas, comments, questions, uh, let me know if you like the lighting or you think my green screen is terrible or this audio quality is garbage, let me know. I'm trying to improve and get things in order from when I start making videos in earnest. So uh, fingers crossed. And until next time, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.